Welcome back to Forza Motorsport. Today's the day we are finally unlocking a rare car. For the past couple of episodes, we have been hard at work in the Builder's Cup, working our way through all of these events. And today's the day we have arrived at Premium Performance. Once we complete Premium Performance, we will unlock a modern reward showcase event where we can get the Ford GT. We need to pick what car we're gonna drive today. We've got some Aston, some Bentleys. A lot of chat seems to want the 911 though. I guess we can go with that. We can always swap our car around later. And it's nice. I don't need to spend any money on it. So <laughs> I have an idea. Every time we start a race in Forza Motorsport, you are usually supposed to go in and do practice, but I'm lazy. So I'm going to skip practice. However, I have a spicy idea. Now the game wants us to pick where we should start. But what if I don't want to pick where we start? What if instead, I want to use a random number generator. We're going to click generate on here and it'll give us a number here. And that is where we will start the race in. I'm going to be on a very high difficulty. So this is going to be rather difficult. And generate. Well, oh, well, that's convenient. P12 and I'm going hardest difficulty in the game. Since we can't do any upgrades, we need to find a new method of making life more interesting for ourselves. And I think randomly rolling a dice to figure out where we're going to start is a good way to do it. This is actually going to be my first time playing this game on the hardest difficulty. So, uh, spoiler alert, I might get absolutely destroyed here, but we'll see. In my testing, the AI's actually been very hit or miss, especially on the opening lap. The AI likes to park it on top of the curve. Anyways, let's see if I can keep up. We're already up to fourth place and we've got to send it. Can I send it around the outside? It's going to switch back to the inside. Get the nose in. Give me the room. We got it. Total time penalty is about half a second. Rubbing is racing. I don't appreciate that. I'm going to go and rub a steward. What? We need a name for the stewards in this game. We're not calling them FIA Giga Chat Chat. It's not happening. Yeah, we should call them Karen. Karen's a good name for it. Hey, 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 understeer. On the road, please. Thank you, Karen, for not giving me a penalty. Why is there so much understeer in this car? Like, actually, I don't understand how there's more understeer driving this than there was when I was driving that front wheel drive Civic. It doesn't make sense. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just apparently horse... Wait, is that man using a Rothman's paint job? Isn't that illegal? It is a Rothman's paint job. It's like a jank Rothman's paint job. I get That's gonna be a penalty. Sorry, Karen. I hate to break it to you. As much as I like Porsche 911, this one in the game does not drive properly. I don't like the way it drives. I don't know what to tell you. After this race, we are 100% changing cars. All right, there we go. Round the final corner. Unfortunately, I think a lot of the AI is gonna overtake us because of my massive... Oh, not bad. Could have been worse. Think what we learned from that is I don't like all-wheel drive cars. Says the man who owns two all-wheel drive vehicles. In real life, they're great. Jack, can you not change car? There's actually no way that you can't change car in the middle of a series. Somebody in chat really just had the audacity to say it's all about building one car, Nick. I would love to, but I don't want to drive this for three hours. All right, chat, back to the RNG. Please be a good position. All right. No, no, no. This is, this is going well. Oh, yeah. Two things would fix this car. Number one, weight reduction makes any car better. And number two, if I could make it rear wheel drive instead of all wheel drive and make it, you know, like a Carrera instead of a Carrera all wheel drive thingy, then it would have been great. But no, here I am. Skill issue. Shut your mouth, chat. I, about a second. I actually hate Karen. Oh, my God. Okay. AI, don't park it on the curb. Or park it right on the curb. Okay, uh, guys, you know you're supposed to stay on the road, right? I'm already up to seventh place, considering I started in 17, and I had a massive crash at the start. It's not going that badly, is it? I am kind of learning how to drive this car. It doesn't drive beautifully, but I think I just need to slow down a bit more. At this point, we see the biggest obstacle for most American drivers, the right-hand turn. Hey, number one, I'm not American. Number two, right on red is a great feature. You can't call people from Canada 
Canada, American. Chat, you're gonna tell me people from Mexico are also American? No, that's not how it works, chat. Mexican, Canadian, we're different. For the simple fact that we just don't want to be associated. Also, hey chat, I'm a UK boy deep down. Where's your tea then? Good question. Downstairs. I actually just sent off my UK passport last week because it expired. I have to get one of those new blue. Yeah, the blue. <laughs> I think I'll upgrade my car before the next race. Since we're now level six, we should have some more parts unlocked, right? I don't know what upgrades I'll have, but I'll have something that I can put on the car. He's gonna have a whopping five choices. <laughs> hey, be nice to me and my upgrades. Oh, the AI's caught up again. Oh, no, no, no. Awful. Actually awful. I'm so disappointed in myself. I'm sixth place in the championship. Why did we decide to do this stupid challenge with RNG anyway? Let's get some upgrades. Let's get an exhaust. Let's get an air filter. I guess I'll... Never mind, I've already run out of car points. Um, I guess I'll get some anti-roll bars then. All right, that's it. Great. Off to the next race. Boys, aren't you filled with such a sense of pride and accomplishment every time you upgrade a car in this game? All right, let's bring back the RNG for race number three. Where are we starting this time? If I could have a good roll, that would be great. I like this game. <laughs> <laughs> this is the best idea we've ever had. You can't actually start a race in first or second, so I guess I'll start third. I'm gonna send it past the AI beautifully up the inside on corner one, and then we're gonna race, and we're never gonna look back. Four laps of Virginia. Oh my god. Remember everything I said about all-wheel drive? I take everything I said back. This is great. All-wheel drive makes cars better. Here's something else you need to know about Virginia International Raceway. This circuit sucks. It is a Massive, massive death trap. It is one of the sketchiest racetracks to drive on in the entire world. I would feel more comfortable driving around the Nürburgring than I do at this circuit. That is how much I do not like this place. It's all just sketchy ass corner. Here's the nice thing about Virginia though. You literally cannot overtake. The circuit is so narrow and so twisty. There's really no good spot to go for an overtake. So if you're winning, in theory, you should win. Sketchy corner. Sketchy corner. How did I not get a penalty for that? That Aston is just stalking me, waiting for me to mess up, and then he will pounce. All right, here we go, and break. All right, final lap of the race. Let's bring it home, 9-11. Wait, uh... Something something machine learning AI. I wonder if I'll get an achievement for this, actually. Winning a race on the hardest difficulty. That's gotta be an achievement, right? P1, hardest difficulty in the game. No achievement for that. All right. Well, after that race, we are now second place in the series. We are now, what, nine points away from the guy in first. Okay. Next race, Road America. Where are we starting this one? No shot. <laughs> People are gonna call this rigged. Third place, yes. Chat, you saw me click it, it can't be rigged. Somebody says you paid the developers. Yeah, what developers, Google? Let's see if we can get another all-wheel drive launch off the line. Little bit of an early shift. The AI is actually gonna make a run on me. Wow, the AI upgraded. Come on, reel him in. Hey, the AI is much, much faster out here. Okay, never mind. he's just left the door wide open. A friendly little tap, rubbing is racing. Karen says no penalty. We're looking good. We've got four laps of this circuit. Come on. What the Those are the type of dive bombs I expect online, not offline on the hardest difficulty, bro. New to Forza, AI now acts like online drivers based on difficulty rating. This has come after years of re research. Sir, if you're gonna go past me, you're gonna go the long way, just so we're on the same page. Stop sending it up the inside. There's a cheese sponsor on this circuit, and that makes me very happy. Block the road! Weave! Cheese! <laughs> That is my new favorite part of any track in this game. Somebody needs to make a car that looks like cheese now and go take a photo with that banner. Boys, look at the mini map. Where the hell is the guy in first? Oh my god. The guy in first is like 30 seconds in front. First place is Max Verstappen. Imagine. We hear him go past and it's just do 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 do. All right, boys, we're on to the final lap of this race. We've actually got a nice lead on the cars behind. When I first jumped in this car, I really didn't like it, but it's 
actually starting to grow on me. Wait, does that say Johnsonville on the inside there? Wait, so are you telling me there's a cheese sponsor and a sausage sponsor on this race circuit? This is my new favorite Jack in the game. Somebody says, oh no, the car level system works. He's getting attached to the car. No, just because I have praised the car doesn't mean as soon as I'm given the opportunity to drive something else, I will. I don't like this car. Give me something better, please. Second place though, not bad. The guy in first place was in an A-class EVR and he was lapping five seconds faster than me. I don't know what to tell you. All I can tell you is I'm leading the series now. Thank you, RNG, for that. Here's what I'm gonna do. I guess I'll go sport tires and suspension. Maybe I'll just go to sport and then anti-roll bars. Maybe bring that down. Exhaust, bring that down by one. What a shocking system. The game really said, how can we make you build a non-optimal car the entire time you drive it? All right, next race. No, we're off to Suzuka for the next race. Let's bring up the RNG. Three, two, one. Well, at least it's not rigged. Ah, oh, man. I was leading the championship. There is no chance I will be leading the championship after this race. If it's like five laps, I should be good. Oh, it's four laps. Okay, we got to overtake people immediately. We've now got some better tires though. So I think in theory, I should be able to just send it past the AI. Let's send it up the inside here. Get a couple of positions. Sorry, sir. When you start 21st position, if you ask me, you have full right to just crash into people. Please don't park it on the curb, sir. Please don't. Please stop parking on the curb. The AI really likes to get to the apex and then just stomp on the brakes. For no See? The, the B Where are you going? The BMW... He just brake checked me. I don't know what to tell you. The AI actually just brake. <laughs> he just. <laughs> okay, we're up to four and we're halfway through our first lap. I think you can see what I mean when I say. I guess I deserve that. I think you can see what I mean when I say, though. The AI is so sus on the opening lap. And then out of nowhere, they just get cracked. Like, first, second, and third place are gone. I really need to hope that the AI just bins it. That's my only hope at the moment. <laughs> Somebody call an ambulance, but not for me. B3, baby. You know what somebody told me on one of my recent videos? Somebody told me on a recent video, I hate it that you're so enthusiastic. I do apologize to whoever left that comment. I got excited. Fire says I accept your apology. Thanks, Fire. Uh, sorry, too enthusiastic to get. Boone corner, coming up to 130R. We'll get on the brake, downshift, turn into the corner, through the left-hander. We run wide, but it's okay. No problem there. Back onto the racing circuit. Take out the board. On the brakes again. Oh, we run deep. Oh, we got a penalty. Sorry. Total time penalty is about seven and a half seconds. What? I'm not doing that anymore. I have a seven second penalty. I don't know who the steward is for this race, but I would just like them to know I will be driving this Porsche 911 right through their office. Total time penalty is about nine seconds. I, 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 I don't even want to talk about it. I don't even want to talk about it. Still third. <laughs> we are still leading the series. That is the main thing. What track are we going to for the final race? Oh, no. <laughs> All right, boys, welcome to Spa. Let's whip out the RNG for the final time. 17th place. All right, I'm gonna send it around the AI on the outside through corner one, right? So I've got to get to the other side of the circuit. I better hope the horsepower in this car works because I think this might be a little sketch. Four laps of Spa. This is gonna be a long, long race in this. Okay, uh, I would really like to get to the outside. Just gonna go through the middle. Sorry, sorry. I don't know which AI there decided to break, but we just got all of them. Okay, send it up Eau Rouge. The AI is going to break way too early for this. I would once again like to remind you, hardest difficulty in the game. Send it up the inside on the Aston Martin. What a lovely move, actually. That was a very nice... Why do I go for a lovely overtake? And then I just go, let's ruin that by cutting the next corner. Oh, the understeer's back and it's awful. The AI's off. He's all over the place. First place is all messy. Gaining, gaining, gaining. First place into the wall. Massive skill issue. B1. I have no idea what is going on. I'm just happy I've got first place. Again. Stop giving me penalties. Oh, that's a penalty. What 
What? Where is the consistency? This is gonna be very close to see if I can actually get the dub against these guys. Oh, they're very close. My penalty is gonna make a big difference here. Oh, they're right behind. I'm so gonna lose first up. I've gotta send it through sector three and just hope for the best. Okay, I'm pulling. I think that might be it. I can barely see where I'm going. It's so dark. If it wasn't for the racing line, I think I would have crashed probably a hundred times. Short line straight to the finish. I think we got him. I think that's gonna be 1.4 seconds. Yes! B1, baby! Woo. Now that I've done that, I have one more event. The Ford GT Reward Showcase. It's on the OG version of Le Mans, okay? Oh, no way! It's a rolling start at Le Mans. Oh my god, that's so cool. I kind of wish we could go three wide on the start for one of these, but anyway. Very cool regardless. We only have one lap of Le Mans. I don't need to win. I don't actually need to do anything. All I need to do is just get the car to the finish line. That's it. So I'm just gonna go for a casual... Oh, sorry. I'm just gonna go for... Remember what I said about the AI just parking it on the apex? Oh, listen to the Ferrari. Bye, Ferrari. See you later. Sentence. Okay, screw it. Got him. Didn't get him. <laughs> I have an idea. If I do a massive corner cut, do you think they can calculate the penalty before I cross the line? Let's find out. Let's see. Don't calculate it. Don't calculate. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> and on that bombshell, we have unlocked the Ford GT. You love to see it.